applying for the internship too? Uh, yeah. Cool. Uh, uh, me too. Uh, uh, I'm Daniel. I'm uh, Jeremy. Uh, uh, nice to meet you, Jeremy. So, have you uh, ever uh, interned at a politician's office before? Uh, no, not in a politician's office. Uh, you? Uh, yeah, once. It, it was cool. <laughs> so, what did you guys do? Anything fun? Oh, all sorts of things. I learned everything about how it is to run a politician's office. I got to uh, 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 hand out flyers, uh, run a budget, uh, uh, apply apply pressure to a wound to save a life, uh. organize files. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, what was that last one? Oh, uh, organize files? I don't know, before that. <laughs> oh, uh, run a budget? No, the wound one. <laughs> oh, uh, apply pressure to a wound after an assassination attempt on a beloved congresswoman to save her life? That one? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're, you're Daniel the intern. Daniel Hernandez. Man, everybody's calling you a hero. Oh, uh, that's nice, but I mean, uh, I don't really think they should do that. Hey, you know, I'm just an intern, just like you. You know, I'm sure. Wow. I, I'm a gay, Latino, national hero intern. But I just happen to be able to the same internship. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, that's right. So, so maybe we can help each other out. Yeah. Maybe we can help each other out. Maybe uh, we can practice our interview. Like, uh, hey, tell me a story about your last position. All right, well, there was this one time. Oh, I bet I can guess what it was. A deranged man came and attacked your boss, and your quick wits saved your life, uh, uniting a divided country in the wake of its tears? Is that what happened? <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, no. Um, one time when I was in the office, uh, I saw Vince Vaughn walk past my window, and I saw him. <laughs> Locked eyes. Wow, that's that, that's really cool. Uh, so where was your internship? Uh, it was uh, it was at a psychologist's office. We um, we specialized in uh, workplace trauma. Oh, workplace and trauma, like uh, if you got critically injured at work and you had to depend on a quick-witted intern to save your life. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you know what? I honestly, I think I'm just gonna leave because well, I, I mean, no, you clearly got this in the bag. You're no, like, no, who's no, gonna no. beat you? What? <laughs> that's not true at all. You know, there's plenty of experiences you've had on your previous job that would make you perfect for this position. Come on, let's not do it like this. Come on. Stop <laughs> <laughs> weird. Stop. All right, all right. All right. Okay. What were your responsibilities? Okay, 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 okay. okay. My responsibilities? Yeah. I was in, I was in charge of the files. I um, color coordinated. Oh, see, coordination. Coordination is very important. Like, for instance, I had to coordinate my hands to make sure I was putting Okay, dude, I get it. I get it. Shit. You're just better than me. It's fine. Okay? I think it's fine. I, I never did anything that heroic. No, look. Oh, my gosh. I, I do not want to come off that way. <laughs> I, I'm new to this whole hero intern thing. You know, we, hey, we all have things at our job that we are not good at. You know what I'm not good at? Making copies. Hmm? Really? Yeah. I mean, we have this really old machine, and every time it would jam, I could never forget how to fix it. Yeah, that's kind of funny because until I figured out if I apply pressure to the. <laughs> <laughs>